Tonight. No, Dad, I broke my last saxophone read and I need you to get me a new one. Uh, isn't this the kind of thing your mother's better at? I called her. She's not home. I also tried Mr. Flanders, Aunt Patty, Aunt Selma, Dr. Hibbert, Reverend Lovejoy, and that nice man who caught the snake in our basement. Wow, and after them, out of all the people in the world, you chose me. Uh huh. Yeah, number four and a half read. Got it. <laughs> Just in the nick of... Mmm, beer. Hurry, Mo, hurry. I've only got five minutes till the music store closes. Well, why don't you go there first? Hey, do I tell you how to do your job? Sorry, Homer. You know, if you tip the glass, there won't be so much foam on top. Sorry, Homer. This is a whole lot of nothing. Ah, I'd rather be watching the boilers. Oh, well, make sure you return those chairs to the cafeteria, Kim. I'm not kidding. Ah, finish with 15 seconds to spare. <laughs> ah! no, no, bo, bo. What's the matter, Betty? The moron next door closed early. I happen to be that moron. Oh, me and my trenchant mouth, please. You've got to open that door. Mm, let me think about it. Uh, no. Okay, okay. But I want you to see a picture of the little girl you're disappointing. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't have one. Come on, Jer, open up. Be a pal. Remember when I pulled you and your wife out of that burning car? Okay, okay. But now we're even. So what does your daughter need? I'll have you know, I wrote it down. Number, number four and a half. Stupid gum. Number four and a half. Read. Woohoo! Mm hmm. And what instrument does she play? I don't know. Mom, where is he? If I don't get that read, I'll sound terrible. Don't worry, honey. I'm sure your father is... Maybe. No. Oh, that's a long shot. Bingo. Don't worry. He'll be here. Clarinet? No. Oboe? No. Saxophone? No. Wait a minute. What was that last one again? Saxophone. Hmm. Lisa, stop playing that stupid... Saxophone! Yes, that's it! Alto or tenor? Oh.